Hey guys, it's Jane. It's Friday and a really frosty Friday it here, is here in Melbourne and I'm here for a Friday Reads. Well, this one is legitimately going to be quite short because um, I actually still haven't finished the book that I was reading this time last week. Um, I've been reading Assassin's Fate by Robin Hobb, which is the conclusion of her Fits in the Fool trilogy. I'm about 70% of the way through. Um, it's kind of consciously reading slowly because I'm at the one and the same time really want to know what what happens but I kind of don't want it to be over so I'm doing this thing where I'm yeah yeah trying to um sort of limit my reading <laughs> and make it last as long as possible um I have finished two short things this week which I will tell you about quickly the first is this one, um, What's Wrong with Religion? It's the new book by Sky Jatani, who's one of my favourite Christian broadcasters. The, um, the subtitle is Nine Things No One Ever Told You About Faith. And just reading off the back here, the nine things are, everyone is religious, how religion ruins the world, getting rid of religion doesn't help, God doesn't exist to be used, and neither do you, the solution, living with God, the radical life isn't what you think, the world is a perfectly perfectly safe place, really, and all you need is love. Um, anyway, this is um, a really quick read. I read through it in about an hour and a half. It's got a whole bunch of hand-drawn illustrations in there. Um, and it is, at one and the same time, a really easy entry-level read and quite thought-provoking. So um, if any of that piques your interest, I would encourage you to um, pick up Sky's book and see if you can have a think about his nine things. The other thing that I have read, this one is, um, this one's super special. This is, uh, I got this in the mail and I wasn't actually expecting it. It's um, a book of cartoons by one of my favourite cartoonists, Judy Horacek, who's a, a, a Melbourne artist. Um, this is um, actually not released yet. I um, backed her crowdfunding campaign and I got this as a reward in the mail. And as I said, I wasn't actually expecting it um, until, you know, at the end of the month. So it was super exciting to get there. Um, this is this is really fun. It's, it, it is out at the end of the month. Um, so if anybody here is a fan of Judy Horacek, um, you can look out for that later later in the month. Um, well, close to the time, I might actually re, um, show you a few of my favourites out of this one. Um, speaking of, of um, Kickstarters, there is 12th Planet Press, which is one of my two or three favourite Australian small presses. <laughs> Okay, I have favourite small Australian presses. Anyway, 12th Planet Press is one of them. They have a Kickstarter going at the moment for um, a collection of called Mother's Mother of Invention and it's going to be a collection of short stories of science fiction um, with a gender theme and robots and yeah feminist robots and whatever and the list of authors that they've got signed up is really impressive and Kay Jemison is going to, has has committed a story and, and a whole bunch of other people I'll put the details for that down below in case anybody else is interested in backing it um when I finish Assassin's Fate <laughs> um I'm not 100% certain what I'm going to be reading I am not Try, I'm trying not to start anything big at the moment because next week is a super exciting week. Two of my most anticipated books of the year are coming out next week. The new Neil Stevenson, The Rise and Fall of D.O.D.O. And also the second um, volume of the um, Nine Fox Gambit um, trilogy, uh, Raven Stratagem, is coming out next week. So, um, yeah, it's a long weekend here in Melbourne. We're going to be going down the coast and it's perfect weather for it not um i hope you're all well love to hear what you guys are up to i'll talk to you later bye